everyone. Hello, everyone. Welcome to the eighth episode of Broken Bonds today. How's everyone doing? Waking up. Yeah, yeah it's a little earlier than usual. Ready. I'm so ready to go. Well, no better wake up call than realizing we were in the middle of an epic boss fight and about to die, seeing as two of our players are at six health. 13 health and Brian's at one health. <laughs> so, um, Brian's riding the red good line. Stuff. She's ready, dude. <laughs> and I walk the path between life and death. <laughs> Great. Uh, we it. got this. I got, I'm just as effective at one as I am at 10. <laughs> oh my God. Bleeding everywhere. Can't see straight. All right. Let's go. So, we last left off. Um, it just the show had just finished his turn, did some crazy stuff everybody goes like oh no and now we're gonna oh and for those of you that might be just joining us this is now pemis ah <laughs> uh, yes you may be wondering mm -hmm. why is that pemis well as a quick recap he ate a demonic heart and he became a yeah, big boy he grew up oh That's uh arcane is it possible to update the art from the Discord? oh yeah yeah yeah, yeah. I can do that. I can do that. oh let me... let me do that for you Take me no time at all. Boom, 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 boom. Um. I'm conjuring. I'm reinstating. Oh, I'm man. probably uh gonna keep the voice until I uh, grow past puberty. <laughs> there you go. Should be up. Ah. Uh... Oh, cool. There he is. Look at him. All grown up. Very cool. Damn. Very cool. Mm -hmm. All right. Here we go. So that's the end of the show's turn. And next we have is the gambler's aura. So the area around the show will be filled with the sound of, of rolling dice and soft jazz. So essentially what's going to happen at this point is is a magical pair of black dice will appear above the show and will start to roll. Now, let me explain to you what the gambler's aura is. Okay. Oh no. <clears throat> so the show is the show, and any of you are able to sacrifice hit points to add to the pot. And the bigger the pot gets, the more intense the effects. And then you roll against him. To be clear, for each one of you that gives hit points, it could be any amount you get to add a die to the ultimate roll. And he always rolls with two. If you succeed, meaning all of you roll together and are higher than his roll, then you get the pot. If you fail, then he gets the pot. You guys get me? We don't have a whole lot of HP to get. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. I'll start things off because the, uh, the show will sacrifice... Uh, let's do that. The show will go ahead and sacrifice. And let me widen this so I can actually use it. Way to go, me. He will sacrifice 15 hit points. Oh. Wait, so, okay, he rolls with two die. Mm hmm He always rolls with two dice. Okay. We, we always roll with what? Uh, for each of you. For each sacrifice. of us. Yeah. Oh. And each of us can sacrifice any amount of hit points. Any amount of hit points to add your die to the roll. Well, okay, I'm sorry, so... guys, but I'm out. Oh, wait, no, no, I'll just <laughs> give one, HP. one hit point, right? And the... Oh, you only <laughs> have <laughs> one HP. You only have one oh, HP. Oh, she I has one now. HP. Oh. Well, okay, Brian's, Brian's out of this one. No crabs for me, guys. Next okay. round. <laughs> but we, we all have to beat his roll or just... Uh, I... All of you roll your dice together and total them, and then you have to beat his roll. Okay, oh, we so each we just have to get one hit point. Yes. Isn't However, just... oh. uh -huh. keep in mind mm -hmm. that the pot gets bigger the more life that is paid. And if the person with more life that is paid is more skin in the game, if they win, they win harder. Got so it. that means that if you only give one HP, you do kind of edge your bets out a little bit. But that means if he wins, he wins hard. He really wins. Wait, so he gets two dice and we each get one? Yes, yeah. but you add your dice together. And there are more of you than him. 
So we collector. will definitely win, right? Math, math. Most so likely, speaking. unless we well, get almost terribly unlucky. Let's just bet you, all you, are our are you, life. Just bet are, all of our health. Are you willing to gamble that? I'm willing to gamble <laughs> half my HP. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> what do we have to lose? Wait, 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 wait. I'll gamble anyways. 33 look, look. HP. Let's go. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Can, oh, wait, Brian, can, can Brian bet her one life? She can, but she will go unconscious. <laughs> but if she gets her life back, oh, yeah. she'll just survive. Ryan, you're worth a dice. Yeah, it's an yeah. entire dice. You may as well it's do it. Whole... And I will be unconscious on the floor for it. Yeah, but when Is we win, you'll get your HP when she's, back. When she's Ryan, unconscious? eat Ramog you'll... for some HP. I mean, no. if it was her turn, maybe. Uh, yeah. huh, okay, let's do the math. Mm -hmm. Without Brian, we have five dice. We just need to beat two dice. If we all roll natural ones... There's no, it's, it's, there, it's that very, would be I'm the like, most. It's very, yeah. We deserve to be have. team party killed if we roll that, honestly. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> pretty much. Killed. How do you roll? Oh, you would just roll a d6. So it'd be, it'd look something like this. That's what you roll. And then each of you would roll that, and then I'd add them all together. Mm. Then I would roll my 2d6. Mm. See if it's all right. I'm all pretty right. sure. Team Huggles. One, more thing. Huggles. Oh. One more thing I should point out. You have mm -hmm. to beat him. So if we tie, I win. Oh, that's some uh, casino Vegas. The house always wins. This is with the six dice. Vegas. There's there's no no we only have five win. dice. The house okay. always wins. We have five so. versus Jody's, two Jody's dice. I think Jody should use her one health, and she'll get it back <laughs> when we win. Right? <laughs> Like she's well, gonna that, get one that? shot by the AOE okay. trumpet, so <laughs> the <laughs> that, is that is a good is kind true. of a good point. Yeah. Yeah. Gonna I mean, die anyway. She's gonna die anyway, may so as well. This is, this is how this works. You're not guaranteed to get your health back, but when you sacrifice what? your HP, it raises the pot, which has different thresholds of rewards, which aren't revealed until after you've paid. And okay. then you make a roll against it. Oh, right. so but you might not get I will health tell back. you, healing uh. is a part of it, but it depends on what threshold you get to. Oh yeah, we might not just like think... one shot it if we want. Uh, Was that just... really? I think we should <laughs> oh, just do wants... it. Uh, yeah. All of our HP. Okay. Jody, use your HP. I can bet. Um... I can bet Take five. I can bet five Take health and go to oh, one. Oh god, you guys are crazy. Right. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> Tell us, why don't you just bet all six? I'm gonna go all in with my one. <laughs> you know, why you not? might die to the all AOE in, trumpet man. attack. You may as our saxophone attack. Okay. Wait, oh. Should I really? Should I really just kill? One? Jody, you're gonna get one shot at anyway next turn. You may as well, you know. I mean, but she gets to go first next turn, you know. Yeah, That's I true. can disengage. And she'll still get to go first. You know what? I'm roll. betting five of my life, all but my one HP. Five? Oh, all right. right. That's I'm five betting so five. Far. All, all right. right. He's throwing down. All right. Wait, so we choose how much we had to bet? Yep. Yes. Yep. Oh, I thought that we had to roll. No, 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 no. You're you would get a die no matter how much you pay. You get one mm -hmm. d six added to the to the to the roll, but depending on how much HP is spent, will raise the pot. But if he has more HP spent than all of you, he wins hard if he wins. However, if all of you have more HP spent than he does, if you win, you win hard. You guys okay. get what I mean? Okay. Nice, right. nice, 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 nice. Uh, mm, okay, I'll also bet five. Oh, that's cool. Lit, 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 lit. Ooh, okay. That's now of things. Right? Yeah, that's 10 so far. All right, let me go ahead and uh, set the mood because it looks like we're going full gambling. That's what I like. <laughs> oh, we're all going to die here, huh? Yeah, yeah. I'm wondering oh, if I just commit no, Sudoku or do I <laughs> try to disengage eventually? And then use all your health range. for that. You meant dice. Seppuku, right? Because Sudoku's the number game. I definitely mean Sudoku. Okay. <laughs> All right, that's fine. <laughs> All right, so Lilu's adding five to the pot. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's what I like to see right there. I'm adding 33 to the pot. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> oh, <that's laughs> like, yeah! I mean, look, Ooh. I'm far in the back. They're not going to hit me anyway, I right? Exactly. Oh, I can yeah. kite. It's not like except we just saw the, him do an AOE except attack. For, yeah, except for the AOE yeah. trumpet attack. Kite. I can I win! Mm. <laughs> you guys, we're not gonna lose, right? All right. <laughs> There's no way we lose. 33 hit points. Here we go. <laughs> Holy shit. 33, oh you got it. Oh, oh. 
We're gonna get it all back. Uh, We're gonna get it all. There's I no way it. six Yo, dice. Yo, Mag is looking pretty Vegas. healthy. Remind There's me to no never go to Vegas in this group. I will add. What? <laughs> what I'll this? add twenty. Are you doing it too? Twenty five. Oh my God. <laughs> okay. Maybe you know. Maybe twenty, so I can pull your bodies out of the cave. If <laughs> yeah, just you guys get one just shot. In case. Yeah, I'm close to Just in case. Yeah, yeah. Know. We'll do twenty. We'll do twenty. Twenty. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna do 20 as well. Ooh! Nice! All right, now it's oh, super God. beneficial for Brian to die to give her dice because we have so much yeah. writing on this yeah, one. Yeah, yeah, Brian. Yeah, I mean, to... if we lose this, it's all over. You're gonna over. have to take one for the team here. That one oh, dice yeah. might be it's the all difference. It's all over. Okay, put my life in the pot. I guess. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. All right, Brian. It still counts if she's unconscious, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Her dice okay, still okay. counts. How negative, I, I, how I negative will, should I, it go? I will confirm. Are you wishing to give your one hit point? You don't have to. You have to do it. You have to. You have to. <laughs> what if we all die? For the greater good of the team. You know yeah, what? You got to do it, it for the team. Let's go. <laughs> all right. Brian will smile as blood flies out <laughs> from her neck and forms a bloody dye above her head. Oh, my God. Don't worry, Brian. We'll be back when we win. Out, <laughs> oh, no. See you later. <laughs> All right. Oh, I'm scared. Is Here's that it? Oh, okay. Is that it? I think that's everybody. Yeah, yeah we all bet. All right, <laughs> here we yeah. go. All right. All right, let Let's... me uh, let me lay it down for you. Let me throw it down to you, cool cats. You want to rock up to the casino and you want to take a roll against me? Then so be it. Gamble Black's got to make that show the fly. Hell, let's have some fun. So, first things first, all of you put a little skin in the game. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six. 6d6. Here we go. Oh, oh the way this is so wait, 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 Maybe we the do show, it one the by show. one. The no show, maybe the show rolls first. <laughs> oh, yeah, right, we, we should see his roll first. Maybe. Doesn't matter the order. Doesn't that matter, we but it. you know. A little here bit. We first. Go. Well, thanks, ah, he's you know. rolling. Oh, he 14. can't beat it. He physically oh, cannot he can't beat it. it. We win. He can't beat it. He can't beat it, but we still got to roll to see how hard he loses. Oh, seven. He All lost right. pretty hard. All right, here we go. Here we go. He put in 15 health. You put in 84. That's a total <laughs> pot of 99. Wait, so, six it? dice at 14? That means on average we lost. We rolled less yeah, than three don't, each. Please don't think yeah, about it. Yeah, we did it. pretty please bad. Though. It's okay. It's okay. Please. That's why we, we had we our bets with yeah, Brian's death. The only way we lose yeah, is if we don't get totally healed. totally worth it, guys. Because yeah, if we don't get healed, then... Uh, <laughs> We doubled. We doubled their score in the end. All right, with a 99 pot, and with you winning that hard, guess what, kids? I got good news and potentially upsetting news. What? The good news is, is that bloody coins rain from the ceiling. Woo! <laughs> bloody coins. Hell, not bad, kids. Oh, oh, oh you yeah. oh. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Jackpot! Down below. Vegas soon? <laughs> Down. We won. We all, all right, all of you gain a plus four to damage, too, as the casino's what? power flows through you. Oh, oh yeah. Um, Worth. We bet the all. show oh, will oh, smile. I'm betting all my health again next round. <laughs> oh. the, show, however, the show, however, will smile and will say, <laughs> <laughs> All right, then. Let's play. And he'll snap his fingers, and a third die will appear above his head. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. What? Wait, he physically can't. I he's, feel like he just he's cheating. Went. He's cheating. No, he's, he, he's the can't. house always wins. Oh. oh. Go ahead, oh. Brian. So it gets harder every time. Okay. Go ahead, Brian. Kill him. Okay, yes, Kill him. let me refer to my cheat sheet. All right. Here I go. To kick his ass. Oh, that's a crit. Oh! <laughs> you rise up, slamming the <laughs> shit out of him. So Brian does that like capoeira style, like get up kick, where she swirls up. Well, pow, 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 pow. <laughs> All right, let me roll your extra damage on that d4. Pow. That's gonna be eight. Plus, that's a secondary hit, I believe so, for another five, eight, five, thirteen. Uh, I do not believe your blood frenzying right now. So that no. is thirteen. 
I don't think I have blood to blood frenzy with. I don't think you've uh, used it yet, no. Yeah. All right, got slammed. Good stuff. Anything else, Brian? Can I use my key to hit him again? You can. The flurry of blows. Yeah. Very do well. I, do I press kicking ass again? Uh, yes, but we only use the last roll, or the okay. the middle roll. Oh, these which rolls. is twelve. Unfortunately, mm. but anyway, that'll work. Sometimes you miss. You got two key left. <coughs> Alrighty then. Anything else you'd like to do? That's it. Alrighty then. Ramag. All right. Am I, I? I don't know if I'm prone or not. Uh, I believe you're in your shell. Believe I'm in. Okay. All right. Hmm. Can I ride the lightning like across him to this mm -hmm. side of him? Yep. <laughs> Lit. All right. And stay in my shell. <laughs> uh, wow. And I did four damage by <laughs> shooting <laughs> through his body. I can't believe I can't believe Ramag just up dashed on Bowser. <laughs> <laughs> All right, good stuff. And then I uh, still have my tick from Bloodstar, I think. Yep. Go ahead and roll that. Boom. You know what? Ooh, Ooh, twelve. Okay. Okay. Ugh. Ooh. How does the plus four damage buff work? Uh, that's if you actually hit. Which oh, oh like an auto did. attack. Yeah, yeah, that's on his like mm. melee attacks, which I did not add for Brian, which you had three, oh. three hits, so that's twelve damage. Oh, bust! <laughs> that was all of my damage, but in bonus damage. So that's yeah, that's fun. Um, all right, Lulu, let's go. Uh, it says when I click my token, impersonated. What does I don't? Oh. Uh, make sure the... Hmm. Strange. You have ownership. Right-click on, uh, Lilu, and then go down to where it says impersonate, and then click that. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Mm -hmm. Um... Okay. I'm gonna use my great axe. I'm gonna go up to him. Oh. Ooh, 24. Oh, God! the great weapon, Master Fuck. <laughs> Oh god, <laughs> that's a lot of damage. All right, that's uh, 17 from Rage plus four from the casino bonus for a total of 21 damage. What? Oh, wow. I was gonna okay. die. Wait, what the um, Whoa, pow! Damn. That's 10 percent of his health. All right. All right, good shit, Lulu. Anything else? That's it. All right, here. What do you got for me? Okay, I'm looking at my notes. I'm still confused by my notes. <laughs> I'm gonna just... I'm gonna moonbeam. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay, moonbeam. And that. then... What is Longstrider? Uh, Longstrider is a bonus action cast spell that increases your movement speed and allows you to dash as oh. a bonus action. So Wait. it makes you, uh, like, Pemus really fast. Okay. 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 Can I, like... Pre-heal anybody? Is that a thing? Like what do you mean? Prepare prepare to heal or something? You you can by using your uh, your action and ready it, but you used it to cast Moonbeam. Okay. But okay, okay, you okay. do have, you know, you don't, don't also don't uh, remember you have your bonus action heal like uh, Balm on the Summer Court, but everybody's yes. kind of full everybody's health right now. Fine so. right now. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. So okay. Okay. Moonbeam goes off. Uh, I'm weak against Radiant and I don't get to get the save. Which I reveal that now because Chad was losing their mind. He forgets not rolling the save. <laughs> <laughs> Ridiculous. All right. Anything else here? Movement. Uh, uh yeah, I'd like to disengage back, like here. Okay. <laughs> like right there. Oh. Goodbye. All right, Hash Brown. Ah, I still have Hunter's Mark on him. I think. Yep. So I shoot the longbow. That's ah, a long hey. bow. Um, and then I have Hunter's Mark and Colossus Slayer. Dude. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what is wrong? Maybe we shouldn't gamble. <laughs> 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 so I was like, what if I roll another one on my Colossus Slayer? <laughs> <laughs> oh At least I got a two. I got a two that time. That <laughs> oh. two really doubled my damage on that Three, roll. That's ten plus two <laughs> from being half health for a total of twelve. Hmm. 
Ugh. We're doing it. He's, Pemis. He's dying. I I swoop in and just stab with booming blade dagger attack. Stab. Oh, crit. 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 All right, here we go. <laughs> crit. Sneak attack. Sorry, I got excited there. Go ahead and roll your uh, booming blade, which is a D8. Uh, I think at this level, it only applies if they move, right? Oh, no, no, you're right, you're right, yeah, 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 okay. So, in that case, we'll just roll this. Nine additional damage for a total of 19. Ooh. Plus seven is 25. Wow. 20. Woo! And, my, my uh, I use my 40 move to fly away <laughs> and yeah that's it damn swashbuckler all right it's time for the show uh -oh. i mean we have full hp uh, what what can he do i should have also disengaged no it's okay i'll heal you All right, here we go. Let's do this. As a bonus action, he will play some smooth jazz and soothe himself. Oh. No. Wait. Oh. oh. That's a bonus action. Huh. And then he's going to smash Brian. Yes. Great. Cool. <laughs> I said yes. Bam. Oh, shit. All right, he'll spin around and miss Brian. Oh, hell. All right. Wow. It's that time again. The Gambler's Aura. So, who wants to play? He'll summon three dice. You know, and guys. he's going to put in 30 hit points. Oh, we have uh, full HP. We have full well, HP. Well, yeah, we can all... But here's, here's the thing, guys. If we don't play the game and lose, what if he heals his HP like we did? I mean, Is we that... each put in at least one. Oh, yeah. Does it work that way? We can do that. Yeah, if you put in at least one. I think we should just put in more. His last attack only did, like, like 14 damage. We could okay. take a couple we hits, even if we gamble. Like... But the... So the more we put in, the more he can lose HP? The higher the pot. Can three mm -hmm. dice the beat six better dice? Things happen. No, that's I mean possibly, but it'd be so all right. unlike. Yeah, let's do it. I'll all put all. Good. I put I put thirty out of my thirty-one health in. Yes. Oh, oh my god. Okay. okay. We're literally all inning. Very oh cool. god. Oh, okay. Wait, wait where? Like um. It's so it's unlikely for us back. to lose. Yeah, right. there's no way we're gonna lose. So there's no way. I mean, you know, I would do. Not if we put uh, all our health in. Think about it. If we put all I'll of do our 30, HP. 38. <laughs> I mean, we could have half the players put everything and half put one. Wait, wait. Yeah. You, did you say he has three dices now? Yes. He has three he dice. Yeah. Wait. Okay. Um, wait. Wait, so now it's six wait. dices versus three. Oh yeah, the people I, in the back in this yeah. group, we can sacrifice everything. The people up close yeah. sacrifice. Yeah, oh, you should, okay, you should okay. sacrifice. You guys should keep your HP because you're closer. Yeah. To oh, they should give up half. Oh, yeah. I was really about to put in. I was about to put in 44. A bit. Yeah. <laughs> 44. <laughs> I, guess. I mean, you could. His last attack didn't even hurt you, so I mean. Yeah, I okay, well, I need it. <laughs> And even if it hit, it only did 14. So as long as you have more than like 20 health, you can tank at least a hit or two. I'll put in 11. Yeah, take 45 of mine. Okay. Lilu's 11. And here you're putting in 45, you said? <laughs> yes. Okay. Okay. All right. Let I think, uh, I'll, I'll front line. I'll front line can put in just a little. You know, it's fine. Yeah, front line put in less probably. Uh, uh, actually, not eleven. Three. Three. What? <laughs> After he oh. raised forty-five, I think I'm okay. Uh, she's gonna grab our bodies if it goes wrong. Yeah, I'll grab your bodies. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna right. follow uh, Lilu's route and do three as well. 
good shit, Brian. <laughs> From Mog? Nice. From Mog, uh, though. 15. We got Ooh. two people to carry me out of there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, Ramog lives life on the edge. All right, in that case, the show's putting up 30 HP. The party's putting up 134. <laughs> that makes a total there's pod no of 134. Right? Right? No, there's, there's no, no way we lose. No All way. right, here we go. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to another round of craps. Here we go. 6d6 versus 3d6. Let's see what fate got in store. 21. We win. That's we win. Ooh, That's we over. can't win, but let's see how hard he'll lose. All right, that oh, is my 10. We won. Oh. We're rich, guys. We're rich in something. Yeah, let's go to Vegas. I, 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 yeah. I have to itch now. now. I'm up yeah. for it. Yeah, Ryan's been asking my us life for a while, in this game. So. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, this yeah. is so <laughs> Looks like you came out on top, kids. All right. Eventually he's gonna get four, and then five, and then six die. Yeah. And then it, now you're at damage of plus four. He's and on die. in addition to that, it looks like you also gain... Oh, shit. AC of plus two. Nice. Cool. Oh, oh, so we're tankier now, too. Oh, yeah. There's no way we die. This game's over. Armor. Oh, that's your armor. The show will smile, and he'll snap his fingers, getting another die. Great. Let's keep playing, if you think you got what it takes. We're just going to kill him next round. Right, right, yeah. Yeah. Four bonus damage. Go ahead, Brian. Okay, I would really like to use my scythe. Oh. Okay. So I'm going to press this button and hope for... Oh! That's a one. That's a big swing and a miss. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> you can still sight. punch with your bonus action. Oh. Then yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll make you a quick single punch macro. Give me a second. I'll call it slap. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna slap him. Okay. There you go. Give him a slap. <laughs> Ooh. Oh. Ah, 12 dead. That's a powerful slap. When your scythe doesn't hit him, but your slap. <laughs> Quack. <laughs> All righty. Here we go. Ramog. All right. Let's ride. Actually, in in prone, am I able to use shock beam? Is it like a mechanism that comes off of the shell, or you can, but you take uh, disadvantage because you're firing from prone. Got it. Understood. All right, I will just ride the lightning through his body again. <laughs> All right. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'll roll bloodstorm damage. Ooh, 12. 12. Nice twelve, my lord. Well done, my lord. Twelve damage. Ow. Oof. Oof. Lilu. Uh, I'm gonna use Reckless Attack. All right, I, I wanna you... use Great Weapon Master for that minus five on attack roll. Does that work like that? That does, that does. Cool. All right. But now that you've said that, the show will smile and he'll use a reaction. What he'll the throw fuck? A, he'll throw a die up in front of him. Make me Arcana checks, everybody. Arcana, what? he's doing something. Oh, he's doing, he's doing something, something, guys. He's he's up to something. I have no Ooh. idea. Oh, natural twenty. Exactly. Me and Pamis know exactly. Uh, that's what two it natural is. 20s. I have no idea. All right, this is what you know. He's throwing up a D6 shield. He's gonna bet on luck to bail him out. So, Lilu gets to attack him. Depending on how much damage she does, that die will increase in its counter. And then that's the die that will guarantee to be rolled when he rolls his dice in his next gamble. Oh. Unless I just kill him, right? Yes. <laughs> Unless you just kill him. Oh. Oh, that, however, will be at advantage. Roll again. Holy shit! Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, well, we don't have to worry about the die. 
Nah, he wasted his ability, yeah. right? Ha, what an idiot. He wasted All right. it. He the fool. <laughs> All right. The die will kind of spin in place, but it stays there. Oh. oh. Loser. <laughs> you thought I was going to attack you. Here, start of turn. Roll me a uh, moonbeam. Um, button beam. Where, where, uh, button. Button. Oh, moonbeam. Oof. Button beam. All right. The die counter will go up to three. Mm. Okay, that's good, right? That's below average? Yeah, that's still below. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, no, it's exactly average. I thought 3.5 is average. For a, for a D6? Because there's no zero. Uh, six. Oh, oh. Let me do mm. math real quick. Mm. <laughs> I don't know. Um. I think am I am I done? No, oh no 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 no! That that's your damage over time. That, you have your I, whole turn. Okay okay okay. You have uh, your whole turn before you. <laughs> <laughs> okay um and now I uh are they is there mog in the way of my ice knife? Uh they all three of them are because it goes like oh, an aura all off him. three of them. Yeah. It goes to adjacent him, and he's a big boy. He is boy. very large. Hmm. Let um, me double check to see if you can make if you actually choose the radius, though. Let me do, double check that for you. See if there's a way you can finesse this a little bit. That's my only like ranged attack besides moonbeam, right? It's no, it's, knife. it's all of them. That's all your only. Uh, no, 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 no. That oh, I was okay. just saying that that is how knife ice work. Uh, ice knife okay. works. It'll hit those three, but. Okay. 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 Um. I don't, I don't think, unless I want to go in and hit him. With Shalele. Yeah, I'm just going to do it. I'm going to go in oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Pull it out her big dick. I'm a Shalele. I'm oh, Shalele. Oh, God. Oh, God. My oh. Shalele. All right, you go in, and that does an extra four for a total of nine damage. Well done, kid. Slapped him right in the mouth, you did. Pup, pup, pow. Die. The, the die counter will go up to five. Uh. Oh. All right, next is Hash Brown. Nah, uh, I think I'm standing in an unlucky spot, so I'm gonna stand here and then shoot my longbow again. Ah, <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh never God. mind. Oh no, I'm that's still in an unlucky oh, spot. That? <laughs> that was worse. Go back. Mm. Go back. Go I can back. still move, right? I go yeah, back. Go I go back. back and wait for my next turn. Oh, that was worse. <laughs> Pemis! Alright, uh, Pemis gonna do another flyby bombing run and stabs with Booming Blade. Natural 20 again. Ooh, a critical hero! <laughs> Alright, it's <laughs> <laughs> a small roll, but uh, that's gonna be 16 damage. Damn, and son. That, and then that was the, a lot of damage. Uh, plus four from the buff, right? Oh, right, right, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Might as well All use right. a bonus action to stab again. All right. For 11. Seven plus four. Mm hmm. And oh. with my 15 remaining movement, fly away. All right. On that hit, the die will go to six and will lock into place. Oh. All right, it's the show's turn. We have to win this or he'll just heal. He'll probably heal a lot. Yeah. And what if his defensive dice makes him immune for one turn? All right, the show will start playing himself a nice jazzy tune. Oh, yeah. Fuck. Oh, yeah. All right. Now the show will lift up his enormous... Axophone, and we'll start to power it up. And he'll sacrifice five hit points. And now he starts a cleaving attack. I'm going to start Ooh, with Lilu. That's why I flew away. I regret coming in. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, but that's four damage. Critical from hit. Bonk. I wish you kill him here. Oh. Yeah. Eight damage, which is half to four, so Lulu takes four damage. That's it? Yeah. 
Don't speak too soon. All right. You're, you're raging, right? Brian. You're raging, so. Swing into Brian. And we'll roll a one and miss. Swing and a miss. All right. It's time to gamble. Ah. So, okay. So he has a 3d6 plus six on his gamble. All right. The mm -hmm. show will throw up 19 hit points. Oh, that's... Okay. Guys, I think we have to gamble again. No, yeah. we, we don't. If we no, make no, the pot he, bigger, if it benefits wins. him. If no, he we wins, just, yeah, we just he's benefit heal. one hit point each, and then we just have to win, even if we win by a little bit, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. Yes. Yeah, yeah. So he's just bet one uh, hit point. Yeah, well, you should bet one, right? one hit point. Yeah. So we'll each bet like one hit point. Yeah. 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 We each bet one hit point. That's it's a good plan. Good. Okay. I bet 20 hit points. Unless. Yeah! <laughs> yeah exactly! <laughs> like, I'll still have half my health left. I'm in the so back. Sakuna's not allowed to go to Vegas. I'm, I'm <laughs> sitting in the back. Stay home. It's, what's he gonna cleave me in the back here? It's, 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 I'm, I'm immune. I'm. He's only had his weak trumpet AoE attack that only does like five damage. Yeah, I, there's nothing he could do to me. We've unless he's been. That way. Yeah. So, how much would you like to give up, Ash Brown? 20. So be it. Mm hmm. Pemus. One. Remag. One. You know. Ear. Juan. Okay. Brian. One is wet. Lilu. Two. Let's spice it up. Ooh. I, I like the oh. spice. Spicy. <laughs> mm hmm. All right. 19 versus 26. And the pot gets up to a 44. Or 45, excuse me. 45. All right. Here we go. 66. Oh. oh! It's over. I think. He's I real, think. He's Wait, really right? Uh, win, right? Cannot beat it. Can, is it possible? Impossible. Uh, it's impossible. Mm -hmm. yeah, impossible. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's see how far I lose. Ooh, I lose quite a bit. All right. That doesn't get you a full heal, but that makes you lose your AC, but you get your plus four to damage. Oh! He sucks at gambling. Yeah, we, he lost his own game. <laughs> yeah, he just he kept losing. He, he will smile so and will summon a fifth dice. Ah, well, that's yeah, uh, yeah. Well, unfortunately, here. he's going to die now. <sighs> die. All right, it's your turn, Brian. I'm going to hit this man with my scythe if it's the last thing I do. Oh. Yay! He wants silent. Blow up. Please tell me there's not more. Please tell me <laughs> my scythe is not gonna kill me or something. Uh oh. Wait, what was that smile? <laughs> I'm already half dead. What's what's the worst that could happen? <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh, hell. Sorry, kid. I let you down. <gasps> Any loot? I don't think we're done yet. Uh -uh. I mean, Valor would right. be looking at us, so... And they fell down, falling into three big old pieces. Oh, okay. She just kind of. All right. She will stand up. Oh shit. Resisting somewhat the shapeshifter's rod, but she is still very much your prisoner. She will cry out, trying to speak. And then something appears behind Hash Brown. Oh. 
When he said he was safe. It's like Hogger and it's Oh god. Wait, Bro. don't tell me it's the golem at the It's front. fucking Hogger, bro. <laughs> Hogger. No, I just no way Hogger yeah, fits in here. I thought you were making a weird. I thought you were making a weird like wow reference. Like it's Hogger. Dude. <laughs> what is he doing here? All right. Uh, it is not, in fact, Hugger. It is someone else entirely. As you see, this individual appear behind Hash Brown. Ah, oh. <gasps> gross. No, it's yeah. our pal. Our what are you turning on us? Well, well, well. It seems that I was wrong. You happen to be competent. Well done. Valoween will look at this man with fear and will try to struggle away, but unable to do so, as the shapeshifter's rod holds her in place. Hmm, yes. Lazarus will look down and will see how his shoes are now covered in blood. Ugh. He will then approach Valoween and will grab her by her neck. Ooh, that's... He will kind of inspect her, like one, like one might inspect a horse, and will say, hmm, I suppose you'll do. Did you really think that you could get away with double-crossing me? You mistake my servant for me. He'll start to crush her throat. Are we She'll the cry bad out. Guys? I don't know. The, the, the no, no, he's, human he's the bad skin guy. On it. Yeah, that, that's true. That's also true. Yeah, Maybe she, they're both evil. The human skin. The human they're skin. both evil. They're both the human evil. Skin. Yeah, yeah. yeah that was he evil, will, he will, evil. He will continue. That fool Blackbriar may have failed, but it seems you have failed me as well. And after I gave you that annoying, petulant child, he will then start to crush her throat more. She calls out to someone to help her, but no one can hear. Mm. Mm. Do we? Are we supposed to step in? Are we? This, this seems like we can Lazarus the will then. Away. Lazarus the will then away. start like rummaging through her pockets looking for something, and I'll be taking this. He'll pull something away from her before she slaps it out of his hand, trying to fight back. He will then put both hands on her throat, starting to finish the job. The thing that pops out rolls in front of you, Lilu. Make me a uh. perception check. Oh! oh. oh. What you, is it? You recognize it because you've seen it before. You recognize it and to it's... be a personal symbol, a herald, a heraldic symbol, a sigil of, 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 of a family, basically. And specifically, that family is... Hold on, let me see if I have the description for you. Because I think I changed this. Let me go find that. Okay, there it is. Hmm. All right. You will find that it is the family sigil of Venisi. Who's Venisi? Well, you've seen it before because it is found on Gallant's sword. On Gallant's sword. Oh, oh. oh that's a child. Mm. That's her brother. Oh. Um, you know, he she's already like uh weakened by the rod, you know. I don't think Silence, prisoner! Oh Jesus Christ. Mm. Don't tell me to shut up. Oh, you God. shut up. Yeah, you don't don't hear it, you really have to like Lazarus will pull out his command rod and will give it a squeeze and everyone will suffer suffocation and fall to the ground unable to breathe. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> word out of any of you and I'll throw you into the cesspit that this creature crawled out of and he will release mm. you and she will start to scream out unable to be heard and he will attempt to finish the job. So it seems that it is revealed that Gallant and her brother as you found out earlier it seems that the um, the leverage that was held over Gallant's head is now no longer the case, for it seems that her brother is lost. No doubt to the machinations of the Chimerist. So now I have a question for you, Broken Bonds. What will you do? Oh, oh God. If we don't oh, follow him, God. like, aren't we under oath by a god, right? Well, let's Maybe go. Maybe we that. just take the rod oh. away, let her fight uh, for herself, yeah. you know? She's kind of let, stepping let me... back here until I started choking. <clears throat> Let me uh, let me explain some of the um, the moral implications in front of you. Um, 
So Toman bid that you satisfy your master's need so that you can perform what is to come next, so that you can get your freedom. Um, it just so happens that he didn't say anybody's name specifically. And as for oath, you are bound by a prisoner's oath, but not one that you were forced to, not one that you made on your own. So you have a choice. You can oh. attempt to... You can attempt to stop what is happening. You can try to stop it. Or you can allow it to finish. If we kill him, does the oath still come into play? I can't answer that. I mean... Uh, seems like he person? could kill us, though, dead right? I mean, so... Uh, okay, but Valoween, do you think that she killed Gallant's brother? Or do you think that she's happened to stumble upon his symbol or whatever yes, or but i dislike lazarus more than i fear valoween all right team huddle team huddle i'm thinking we just right, put right. the rod down let her fight will, for herself i will give you some time to speak but understand that he is choking her so you do not have an ah, infinite shit, amount of time ah, he will ah. kill her so i will give you 10 minutes of in real life time to represent the time in game Okay. Start discussing what you want to do. Like anime, ten, 10 seconds. So clearly, this is pretty messed up. What we're witnessing: a man choking <laughs> a woman to death slowly with I both hands around her neck. Um, a pause we were going anime. to kill her. <laughs> well, she also just tried uh, to kill us too. That and died yeah, oh, so that is floating yeah. owl. So. But Lazarus oh, we is like. Her. Yeah, we bombed her. Remember. I mean, I hate Lazarus. I that hate Lazarus. That's true, too. Yeah. Wait, but okay, but Valoween seems evil, whereas Lazarus just, Lazarus just seems like... Can a we kill them both? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, why don't we take uh, the rod down, yeah. let them fight each other, and then we... Oh, we take the rod, stuff it back into Ramog's shell, mm -hmm. have her be able to fight them, and then when they're both weak, we step in. Big <laughs> <laughs> I mean... <laughs> I still mm. have the coin with Vesivin too. Can you just like oh, summon them and be nah. like kill both of them? Oh, just throw I mean, more they're killing each other for us right now. Yeah. True, mm. true. So no, mm. you have to like who has the rod against you I or think, something? I think I have it like it's just. Is it a, out, like a salt right? lick, or, like a rock we pulled out? No, there's a, there's a rod. There was a rod, there was a rod. A rod. Yeah, they're mm. both. So wait, if... do we think that um Lazarus is evil? I He's, just, I, mean, I don't like him bit. because of Okay, Galen's brother? He, like, encamp- That is evil, like, capturing her brother and Galen. Right, yeah, he's not right. a good person. Yeah. What okay, about the human Valine, skin and the beating Valine heart? And the... tests all these animals. Yes, yeah. but Valine, oh, also, They're both evil. They're both evil. Let's kill Valine Valine we don't. Better. We don't know she killed the brother, though. I mean, may probably. Mm. Okay, but, you know, like, what if we kill Lazarus, keep the rod on her, and then ask her questions, and then kill her? Well, we might need her help to kill Lazarus. Lazarus seems pretty strong. Yeah, he we haven't yeah. seen him fight yet at all. So. He all healed he us a few like times in the cave. Yeah, yeah, he's he's our friend. Who's our Honestly, friend? Honestly, maybe he we healed us the... in the cave. Remember? I hate. He didn't even help us fight. We could oh, he healed the us. He did heal us. Evils. What's the lesser two evils? Well, Valoween clearly because she's like very pretty and Lazarus. That's what? your <laughs> what's wrong with this <laughs> superficial society? <laughs> We're prisoners, know, anyways. Wait, no. Valerie has like this table over in the back of like all these yeah. animal tests and the, the human skin yeah. thing, yeah. and yeah. not the, the human the heart, heart that you. Have. I'm simping for Valerie. <laughs> that is pretty evil. The strange creature with six faces outside. Look, um, all I'm saying, Lazarus is standing right over a giant well of darkness. We just kick them both in while he's holding her by the neck. I think she lives there. Just kick it, them in. She, she lives she, in the world. Oh, she right? lives there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay. Shit. That's well, true. Okay. So let's say that we kill or try to fight Lazar Lazarus. Lazarus. Yeah. Um. What about our oath? Maybe we just I, fucking die. Because I'm pretty sure I thought our oath was that like we had to kill her. But Wait. now I'm understanding that it's to satisfy our... Whoever we made is, our oath to. Is there an oath if the guy who made you take the oath is dead? I'm just curious. Like, how does that uh -huh. work? Does that is really not. Mm. That, that oh. is something that there is no definitive answer for because your character doesn't know. Hmm. Okay. So we just Wait, what if the oath still all? stand? Because your, your, your oath is under like a god, not, not Lazarus. Ooh. Lazarus. But it's too, like, to satisfy Lazarus. I want, want an evil it, right? demon girlfriend. Look. If we kill Lazarus mm. and Valoween, we satisfy our oath and... And we... Exactly. Yeah, yeah. And, and he's dead. 
Just kill them all. Let's mm. choke him from behind. Wait, Honestly, wait, we should I find out. Wait, evil. We should find out what happened to Gallant's brother, right? He's like, probably dead. Still, One of them knows. Part. These are the, we're looking at the two people who know where he could possibly be, and we're gonna kick them into the uh, fucking well. Uh, we're like, probably wait, dead. I'm assuming okay. he's dead. Um, yeah, maybe that's we probably turn a good on assumption. Lazarus and make him tell us where Gallant's brother is. Or Halloween, and then... What if he does that squeezy thing? Yeah, when you oh, we need yeah. a squeezy yeah, thing, we have to... Oh, yeah, he has the squeezy yeah. thing. I don't know how he defends... We need a free Halloween because she can't be squeezed. That I can answer for you, Ramon, because you are a rune mage. Very cool. Um, the rod of command that he's using is enacted directly to the runes around your necks that forms your collars. Mm -hmm. You know that all it takes is a simple errant twitch or will for him to cause you pain and even death. Oh. If you are so to turn no against Lazarus, can... you need to move in in six seconds. It needs to be before he can react. So one oh. one round of action. We get one specifically. Round. And well, we... I don't see a health bar. So and we don't oh know my how god, this is, is so risky. What if we just free Halloween from the rod? Yeah, that's uh, what I, I honestly think that is our that's best. Just let them fight each other, right? They need to um, fight each other. Like she was floating. She's got to be pretty strong. To trip. And shove the rod back into his face. Yeah. He's gonna have us fight her because he has control of us, anyways. All right, right? so. No, but maybe uh, she'll oh, like jab him in the eyeball or something since they're so close right now. <laughs> gonna try and kill us. Uh, hmm. So one I, of us hides the, the rock, one of us gets the rod. And I don't know, the rest we can try and push him really hard. <laughs> Endless we abyss. Have six seconds <laughs> him into the oh hole. Oh my god! Him into she can the fly. Hole. She can fly or some shit. I yeah. think, right? She likes that. Yeah, yeah. Stuff. She was floating. She lives earlier, in there, right? Yeah, yeah. She, she lives there. She likes that's her home. Wait, she likes it there. I got just... some bronze keys from Gallant before, right? Did I ever find out what they did? Oh no! Not yet. I don't think they'll do anything here, though, right? You know, just you know, off chance that they just happen to be the keys that magic col colors are. You know, just to. I actually right. don't know what to do if he has control of us and can kill us. Yeah, if it's like suicide well, squad. Um, yeah, it sounds you. like. Yeah, we got we got three minutes. Uh... Is the <laughs> so is the thing around our neck controlled by his like by something physical? Like can we yeah, take by it? A, control a rod, rod of command? There's a rod that he holds in his hand. Okay, can we take oh. the rod first? You you can most certainly try. We should oh. all try to take the rod. What if we try to deceive him instead? Be like, this was our oath. We are supposed to like swear to you to kill Halloween. It's our job, and then he lets go, and then we ambush him. That's a, not I mean, bad. Okay. Wait, we, we can ambush him now, right? While he's busy no, choking. Like this while he's busy choking, yeah. While he's busy choking, yeah. busy choking. While he's busy while choking, he's choking, choking his hands busy. her, we'll choke him. <laughs> yeah, he can't <laughs> choke her and choke us. Yeah, his hands I think are if he's distracted, someone should try to sneak and grab the rod from him. <laughs> so okay, maybe we deceive. While talking to him, and somebody else sneaks and grabs the rock. Oh, uh, shit. Okay, uh, what's the order of movement here, Kaden? Are we going off init the initiative? Uh, we, wouldn't be, uh, we wouldn't be going off initiative. We would be going that all of you get an action, and then I get a reaction. Because oh. you would be acting as the aggressor. Okay. okay. But you would get to choose the order that you'd go in. So every possible advantage of it working out would be given to you in terms of initiative. But you can still fail. Because understand that if you fail mm. to get the rod from him and he knows your intention and it's his turn, that's it. Okay, we have one oh, round. We have one we're round. We're going to get our one next snap. So the bro. safe thing would be just, just let we him do it. Let him we we can, like, I'm pretty sure all of us have to try to grab the rod. Yeah. Because what is it like? One of us rod. is going to, right? I mean, I, I, he did heal us in the cave. Valoran just tried to guy. kill us. But I'm, I'm just saying. Kids. She kills kids. She kills like, kids. Right? You know, I just want to say, it, it, Saikuno, that is amazing. He, he's what? still playing it from, like, like the role play is great, because you're like, but That'd guys, be, he didn't... He's helped he, us a little yeah, bit. Like, yeah, and I She's like, only I like, tried to kill us this whole time. It's fucking great, so, dude. I mean, he's doing a great job, dude. I love it. I mean, like, yeah, because we came to kill her first. He had to heal us because he needs us to do his bidding. Oh. Uh, alive. Mm. All right, I think yeah, I, I don't even think, think, I don't think either of them are good. And he was so evil to Two minutes. All right, okay. I, th I think we, we I think we kind of got a plan here. Do we? Evolving what? What all taking his rod, different. removing Valoween's rod, and um, yeah. And then what? <laughs> okay, okay, okay. And so hoping it we works will out. Hide um. the control rod. 
in One my shell so that he has to like focus harder to grab her and then we have a better chance of grabbing the control rod from him okay so mm -hmm. half of us need to get like right. split with the rod from each one okay uh i think we're ready seconds. arcade him since right. i'm closest do i am i making a lunge for the rod or something I mean, yeah, six yeah. seconds is essentially one. It's enough time turn, for all right? of us to go. Oh, right? that's one round. That's one round. Basically. So you have <laughs> one round worth of action. Got it. All right, here we go. You have decided on your plan. You've decided to act. So, Brian, would you like to go first, or would you like someone else to go first? Oh, okay. I. You know what? I, who's the I'm Who's done. the best? The thief? sneakiest. Yeah, the uh, sneakiest thief. I think would it's... it be Pimus? Pimus. It would be Pimus, and I'm gonna sneak <laughs> by. So, uh, Arkean, what's my fly speed again? Sixty. Uh, 60, yeah. So with bonus action, I can fly 120 feet in under 6 seconds. That's a lot of momentum. Hey, you want us to do the math on that one? <laughs> <laughs> how much, how much you think, how much you think? How much, in, <laughs> how much velocity and weight is that? Because I'm really also weird. grown in size as well. <laughs> with dragon yeah, he's about, he's about 220 pounds, I'd say. Joking, boy. <laughs> Alright. If I... Bear Okay, Man, so he is 10 feet away. So if I walk back 50 feet here and bonus action dash, I'm covering 60 feet and just ramming into him from the south, from the, his okay. bottom side. So what is it that you're trying to do? I'm just trying, I'm just trying to like knock him off balance and push him in. Like best case scenario, okay. he falls in and dies. Worst case scenario, right, he's prone. Got it. Athletics check. All right. Uh, can I get advantage because I'm flying at You six. have advantage. Oh, let's go. Uh, athletics check. <laughs> <laughs> good thing you have advantage. Yeah, very good thing. Very good thing. Zoom. Bop. Try again. <laughs> are, you, are you grabbing the rod? Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. oh, God. That is right. really you strong. Will, you <laughs> slam as hard as possible into the heavily armored dwarf of Astaroth, the god of strength. And oh great. my that, god. That makes sense. That does make sense. You bounce off of him like a pebble <laughs> being thrown at a wall. A he'll luckily turn he won't. slightly. <laughs> I need a re he won't <laughs> react for six seconds, he though. Turns luckily. slowly, his eyes glazing with hate at your daring. <laughs> to send it no, him. I just tripped, I swear. <laughs> <laughs> I just tripped. Who's next? Who's next? Uh, oh, God. Well, why did you try to grab the rod? Oh. The action is done. He's Who's trying next? to tackle him into the. Fuck, I guess we committed now. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah, I guess. Okay. <laughs> no, you guys can still play it off like a trip. <laughs> <laughs> Abandoned oh, pair. Throw him under the bus. Throw him under the bus. Oh, fuck. Wait, throw him under the bus. Oh, no. Who's next? Go ahead, Brian. I want to just reach for the rod, but I, is that like all I can do? Do I have any advantage or anything uh, that I can do? Who's rod? Valoween's or... No, we need Lazarus. No, I, I need because if we don't grab Lazarus, I'm pretty sure we're he'll just us. kill us. Yeah. <laughs> Control rod. Maybe if you wish to try and take the command rod from him, you'll have to make a sleight of hand check. Okay. Oh yeah. uh, well, or you could attempt to grab him with athletics, but he is very strong, as you've just seen. Yeah, he's the god of strength or whatever. It's so also I'm. God of strength, yeah. yeah, I'm gonna just do a sleight of hand. <gasps> oh no! Wow. Let's oh. see. Let's see if my now I am I do have high wisdom because I'm a cleric, but let's see if I see you. Oh! All right, Brian, quick with speed, snatches the rod of command. Oh my god! Oh. Run, run away! Run, 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 run! run, 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 run. Wait, wait, can I run away? Off button. I have, I have. Yeah, I'm gonna run, run away. Run as far as you can. I'm pretty sure I can run. Wait, this like far. put it under a rock or something. Feet. You have more movement because you're a monk at higher level now. Goodbye! <laughs> I'm gonna go under the zoo. We might need you. Don't um, go too far. <laughs> okay, well, can I, like, can I chuck the rod? Wait, I can we? No, wait, you should keep it. it. Can keep we it. turn the collars off somehow? With the rod? You might be able to, Ramog, because you're a rune mage. Uh, Ryan does no. not know how to use it. Should I? Okay. Ins okay, can I maybe not run far? Maybe can I run? No, no, I'll, I can. I can shove it in his. Oh, <laughs> I can run to you, right? With like. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. 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 Okay. And we're far away, right? All right. So now we're we gonna try to get the rod from Valoween. 
All right, okay. you grab you grab the the command rod from Brian, and yes. now make me a big boy arcana check. I'll give big you boy. advantage. But that's the first All time right. you big boy. Here we go. Uh, big boy arcana check, baby. Oh. Again, you might oh, get higher. Oh, oh, yep, yep, yep. Big boy arcana check, baby. Oh. 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 Okay. Oh All God. right. Ramon, so takes a, Ramon takes a look at the rod and quickly trying to understand it's it's kind of twists it here, adjusts it here. And then eventually <gasps> And so your bonds are broken. Oh, oh that's why they call it the thing. He said the thing. He said the roll the credits. We won. Every, everybody turns and looks at Bart. Sprite, yes. All right. As soon as you break the bonds, Lazarus will look at you with fear, oh. understanding what has just happened. Okay, who goes next? Uh, so are oh, we we're... saving Valoween I, then? I, I mean, think we could. We're free we literally just walk We've away got... right we now. Could we could just... Just... Wait, wait. Oh. We should we ask leave. about the no, kid. We, we should make them. him tell us stuff. Wait, wait, wait. We are need we... info. We need to save Gallant's brother. Yeah, we need info. I think, okay. we, like, mm. if we're this strong, we can just ask him for info. Oh, he's kind of choking out Valoween. But yeah. we got our uh, rod yeah. of the Chimera as well. Right. That is correct. So, so to, right? to, to, to be clear about it, you are still under oath, but the other clear thing is that now he can't instantly kill you, but he still has the life of Valoween in his hands. Oh, true. So oh, fuck. We're, st we're still an active pseudo-initiative as we are right now. Okay. So so um, Pemus has went, Brian has went, and Ramon has went. Who's going next? Do we hmm. remove our time? Is there a way well? to like... Yeah. yeah, I feel like we actually can't kill him. I think it's up to like freeing Valoween. Can we, we convince him to stop choking him? her for a second, and we could talk about it? <laughs> you can certainly try. Oh. Okay. Mm. Uh, what is that? A, is a skill check? Yeah. Okay, I would. Okay. 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 I would like. Okay. I'd like to go. All right. Um, I'd like to try Lazarus or convincing Lazarus just to stop choking her for a second, because he knows that our neck thing fell off, right? All right, so maybe he will. He's scared. You know, yeah, he's scared. Take a minute to just talk. All right, go yeah. ahead and uh, go ahead and talk to me, and uh, then you can make a roll after. Okay, what you say okay. Matters. All right, Lazarus, we have broken our bonds. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! I'm talking about it because we have questions. Your questions don't matter to me, slave. Or else, You'll be Lazarus. back in your chains, he'll say, but not quite with the amount of confidence that he had before. Ooh. Make me a intimidation check. Oh, okay, okay. Very, very intimidating. So intimidating. <laughs> this drop of water hits him in the mm. face. <laughs> All right. Uh, you will. Okay, two things. Back me up. Well, Lulu, back me up. <laughs> two things will happen here. First, his attention is on you. So you've gotten his focus split. Ah. Uh, so is, okay, okay. So who would go next? Are we saving Halloween? Should I um, take, the, take the rod. Okay, okay. I. She I, knows I, where the brother is, right? He's distracted. Yeah, but so we, we also to... have to make it so she can't fly away if we free her. So we need to uh... kind of have the chimera rod nearby, which I am. But maybe just get her out of his murder Hold. hands. Yeah. Yeah. He yeah. Needs yeah. To out. Uh, okay. Can I try okay. to cut off his hands? Nice. He <laughs> he's. Okay. I'm pretty sure he's a lot right. of. So he might be too strong. Yeah. So here's here's how this is gonna work. You can certainly try to do that, and that is going to be a clash versus him. So this is how it's gonna go down. You okay. can certainly swing your axe down. His he, his attention is split, and we are in a cinematic moment now. So you can certainly try to cut off his hands, but be warned: should you fail and miss, you will instead cut off the hands of Halloween. Oh, Do no, it. she's she's a chimera. I mean, she can attach she's those back. Yeah, she right? can grow too. new hands. She, she can probably get those it. back. That's okay. Looks like yeah, she would enjoy it. So, the gamble is yours to make. What what do I have to? What's the attack roll I have to hit to cut off his hands? To... You make it. You make a. Uh, you make an attack roll, and then I will roll athletics to try and avoid it. Oh. Wait. Oh. If you cut That's off awesome. her hands, I'm, doesn't she still die because he's choking her? Yes. yes. <laughs> oh, and she doesn't have hands. <laughs> <laughs> what if? Okay. 
Uh, wait, he's wait, not the god of athletics. He's the well, god no, of strength. I was gonna say, what if instead you try to push her into the hole? Um, because we like still have he has the rod. To be strong. Yeah, and he, he's holding her. Yeah, he has. Oh, All right. Can I, try I think I think I should remind you of something here. Um, he has a plus seven, so you have a bit of a power scaling what he is, and he's not a god himself. He follows the god of strength, but you are also a raging barbarian. Raging. If there is anyone here oh, that can match his might, it's you. Oh. Ooh. I'm inspired. Guys. Go for his hands. Oh, Go for his hands. the opponent. <laughs> off his hands. I use reckless attack for advantage. Okay, you're going for his hands. That's what I like to see. Go ahead. Oh, Roll twice. Ah, uh, Valoui. Hope you enjoyed having hands. <laughs> <laughs> and a life. <laughs> do I uh, do I do a, a great axe? Is the best chance, right? It doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Bam. Yep. Okay, Roll twice. All right. Fuck it. Okay, I like what I'm I- oh, 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 no! Oh, no. Oh, Alright, yeah. so we have a 19. Both oh pretty God. good. D20 yeah, plus 7. Oh, I'm gonna try ah! to take Oh, and there what goes her the? Hand. And, her hand. and she doesn't have hands. And, 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 and she doesn't have hands. Oh, oh, all right. <laughs> yeah, you know. Raises her axe above her head and brings it down. At the last moment, Lazarus will smile and will grab onto Valoween's hands and instead your axe will bite down on the flesh of a satyr, one of your fellow fae. Wait! Wow, no, you're killing your own people. Like, what the fuck? One fae, and she will scream, No! And then Lazarus will grab her by her throat to finish the job. Oh, so... Oh, wait, we still have... We still have... have, have, have what am I supposed to do? Hash brown! Hash brown! What? You're um, our only hope! Ah, oh, right, right. Okay, um, maybe, okay, maybe yeah. you can run take over the here. Rod. Take, yeah, I'm gonna snipe him in the hand. No, 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 Wait, take her up? I mean, uh, the one that's like the shapeshifter's bit. The shapeshifter's bit. Oh, yeah. She has you no could. hands. Even if she gets some powers back, what's she gonna. She might be able to, like, she's really teleport powerful. or something. Yeah, she's yeah, really yeah. <laughs> Wait, as Wait. soon as I chop her hands off, I'm like, I'm so sorry, miss! <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, shit! Wait, 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 I'm sorry. Why, why, why shouldn't I just snipe his hand, right? I, feel I, I have like good aim, guys. I have good aim. <laughs> snipe his hand. I mean, we don't mind Valoween dying. I no, but so. she had. Doesn't she have the she has info. Doesn't she know she info on Gallant's brother? She that does. Is, um, we need, I'd rather Lazarus he, die. Lazarus yeah. would also have some info on Gallant's brother, he? right? Some, because like... he's the one who gave the brother mm -hmm. to her. Uh, I mean, even if I... we pull the rod down, she has no hands, is bleeding and choking to this death. This is true. This is true. Who knows if she can defend herself, right? Well, maybe we just let her try. Um. <laughs> who has the rod has anyway? Hands. <laughs> yeah. Wait, where is the rod right now? How is uh, this so working? it's I think it's on me. Okay. So oh. you'd have to like Can't... football pass it and then run down the this, mm. this I don't know if you have enough well, movement. Well, yeah, I'd have to I'd have to revert his movement. Let's see where he was. He was okay. there. He has enough movement. Oh. Hmm. Wait, Can we just wrap you guys, it up there's two different pot. rods. Yeah, one is the Ramag... one that Ramog has the one that Lazarus was using to control us. Not that one. No, no, no. I have that one. Yeah, so you don't have to run back to Ramog. I thought he just had both of them. Yeah, Ramog. No, I have the rod. You had it and you gave it to Ramog so that he could runecraft it. What about the shapeshifter's bane? The shapeshifter's bane should be in Ramog. So he has two rods. Oh, Ramog has both of them, I thought. Yes, he has both of them. Can he just put the shapeshifter rod in his pocket so it's not affected him? Valoui. Yeah, well, yeah, well it's not yeah. his turn. It's not his turn, so Hash Brown has to be the one to move up and do it. that. Uh -huh. But he can do that. You can do all that. Or I could know. snipe his hand. You could do that. Oh. Wait, look. you know Hash Brown <laughs> how is, can do whatever. How is a choking, handless want. person gonna defend themselves? I I will support I've... whatever decision you make. I'm just concerned because if that is Hash Brown during this logic, fight. then yes. <laughs> A, a choking, mean, handless yeah. person can't possibly fight I back, think, right? She's the chimera. So won't she be able to, like, do some shape-shifty, changey stuff? Out of the choke? Ashbrown, make a decision! Okay, I'll just go can... take the I rod follow down. follow whatever decision. <laughs> I'll right, just okay. go grab the rod and know. put it in Ash my Brown pocket. grabs the rod, puts it in his pocket, disabling the shapeshifter's bane. I think that's everything. she grow her hands back yet? No. <laughs> 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 well, what happens now? That's everyone's... Oakley, Oakley. Wait, is that, like, full... 
move? You have no yeah. bonus actions or okay. Cause just... Wait a minute. Wait. How much range does my bow have? <laughs> you have plenty of range with your bow. The problem is it takes an item interaction to take it out and then an action to disable. Oh, okay. Uh... Hmm. I thought it, maybe it was a bonus action or something. All right. Here we go. So, as the shapeshifter's bane fades, Valoween receives the enormity of her powers back. Oh, we're so fucked. The no, shadows from the well are now able to be beckoned and called once more. She will speak. The shadows reach out and grasp Lazarus by the throat. <laughs> pulling him free and holding him up. Yes! Halloween will lean back, her hands missing, bleeding from her wrists. <laughs> but her attention, her attention is not on Lilu, but rather on the man who came to take her life. Let me ask you something, dwarf. Do you fear the night? And with that... <gasps> Pull the rod out! Pull the rod out! <laughs> um, <laughs> it's not my turn. <laughs> it's not, not my turn, turn right? It's you're, not you're welcome. You're welcome, Val milady. Valowin will stand up and her wrists will restore her hands from the shadows. Oh, oh fuck that girl. Thank God. Okay, listen, that was a mistake. I was trying to cut off Lazarus's <laughs> hands. Do you Sorry, realize this? Oh. oh, shit. You are all intruders in my home. But I know that you have attempted to stop what happened here. So you will have a moment to speak. And if that device is pulled from your pack, halfling, you will all join him. Don't pull the rod out. Do not pull, pull the rod, the rod out. out. What's she gonna do if we can't do it? What's she gonna do if we pull the rod out? We have We have a moment to speak, right? Okay, we have yeah, let's ask about questions. the brother. The Gallo's brother. Time, time to make yaps. Valor. In prison somewhere, golden, gilded cage. Do you any know, do you know anything about him? You must be speaking of the dwarven child that was sent to me. Yes, yes. I know of him. He yet still lives. <gasps> he is one of my subjects. Why do you ask? His sister misses him greatly. Compassion. Very well. He's useless to me anyway. You may take him. Oh. Uh, oh, oh, oh okay. I thought we were gonna have Thank to murder her for the shit out of her. Oh my god. Our free um, child. Ask her if she's got some more hearts. <laughs> <laughs> some of those hearts we can eat. I'm sorry. Free child. Ooh, I like that. Ooh. Free child. Ooh. Free child. Ooh. <laughs> what the fuck? You have to think she has those hearts, you know, those power up hearts. <laughs> Can I ask any... about hearts? Yeah, a couple oh, more of those. Hey, we saw your hearts that none of us did anything to back there, and everything <laughs> is still there. You got any more of those? <laughs> got any more? Extra yeah, hearts. got a couple more of those <laughs> edible power up hearts. <laughs> I'm sorry. Just... Ooh, free child. <laughs> That's going to stick with me forever, dude. I'll never forget that. Oh, that's good shit. Okay. Oh, all right. All right. Uh, so where is the child? Oh, exactly. Like that she'll roll. Thing. She'll roll her eyes and say, "It is within the prisons below. I will release him to you, as long as we come to an understanding." Okay. I am so okay. I just gotta point out. You know, I wasn't aiming for your hands. I was. <laughs> yes, I'm aware that it is incompetence that led you to yes, attack me. Yes, I'm. Yes, super incompetent. Yes. You want anyone else? Yeah, what? I'm real. I'm real sorry about the kamikaze owl as well. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we'll take the child and go. Uh... You were only sent here because of Lazarus. Where? I'm pretty no, sure you're pretty we're still evil. under oath. Oh. Yes. Well, oath you say. So. Yeah, so can I you wonder. break oaths by chance? <laughs> I can. Oh. Oh. What? Cool. You could do that? She Shall can break oath. She can. Wait, you're so cool and attractive. Please break our oath. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 
if you can break our oath and give us the child, we have no no reason to be here anymore. I will give you the child in exchange for solving the problem you created. But to free you from your oaths, that is a powerful cost. And I would incur further punishment from Babylon, which is why oh. I suspect that you're here. Oh, yeah. Babylon. Babylon. Oh, yeah. What are you going to do about that, Brian? Oh. Um. Ooh. Yeah. Pretty, I, like... She seems pretty close to Babylon. Uh... Would you like the stick? The. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like the stick? I hand the stick over to Brian. No. Wait, you pulled it out? No, 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 don't pull it out, don't pull it out. Don't no, out. like wrapped in a Wait. little cloth, I hand it to Brian, Fuck wrapped in a bro. small cloth. <laughs> you want to, you can just take that? You want the stick? <laughs> Wait, I actually don't do, know what to do in this situation. Use the stick. No, wait, get the child first. <laughs> yeah, Let's wait, get the child. I'll get the child first and then you use the stick. Look, no, killing her would and fulfill then. our oath anyway, right? Yeah. Yes. Oh, this is true. Wait, what is the what is the like issue with uh breaking the 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 oath? <clears throat> well, we every die. time you every time you break an oath, it is blasphemy against Babylon. Okay. So, Babylon know, Babylon knows whenever any oath is broken, which means that depending on the level of the oath, you could incur his wrath. But I suppose more importantly in this case is that one of your party members is a zealot and follower of Babylon. Wait. And I and I wonder if Brian would be okay with such blasphemy to be finished. If you yeah. promised me that you were gonna kill someone, but then I died, is that promise still It's we still made an oath to a god. Oh. So I think it stands because even though he dies, we, we made the oath. Okay, but, well, but they, they didn't say, like, specifically, we can kill Valoween with compassion and love. Ooh! I See, I was gonna say, beating you know, her. there, was, the there was no timeline, you know? Maybe, you know, he, they didn't said say when. when. I could oh, kill Valoween in, in 80 years. years. Yeah. 80 years. 90, even. Oh. Yeah, but I want to see the progression of uh, Brian and Babylon ASAP. Well, okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, realistically true. speaking, yeah, I never... want the next chapter of my romance novel. Yes! <laughs> Actually, Brian. yeah, evil romance. Can you make a note that, like, won't be fulfilled for some time, right? I guess that's up to Brian, right? To, like, decide what? if she's okay with that. We, we can solve it's everything. Kid first. We can solve Maybe everything by not. beating her to death. We could, we could do that. That also We always have the stick, mm. just mm. in case, right? So our priority should be to... Save gonna um, Valor. Brian, not Jody. Brian, yes, Brian would very much want to kill Valoween in order to fulfill the oath, and she doesn't really care about Galloween or not Gal Gallant's oh, pull, out yeah. okay, pull, pull out the stick. Pull out the stick. Stick. Like Force a hand, wait, Brian. How about we can, we can have both. First. Get the kid first. We kid can first, do both. Then pull out the stick. Get the Fuck. Okay. All right. Um. So can she we have the child? Hand, right? <laughs> <laughs> Ground shipping? <laughs> I'm sorry. Ooh, free child. She said he was in the prisons underground, right? Yeah. Yeah, she can yeah. spit him out, uh, spit him out of the well. I'm sure with the shadow magic. Yeah. Yeah, the cool. shadow hands. Yeah, I guess we're all in agreement. Everything's fine. Yep, we'll no. just take the child and go. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Very well. So be it. Oh. Bro, Valor... Val she misses this? <laughs> Bro, take him back! <laughs> what the fuck? In his hands? Yeah! <laughs> Please stop crying. Please stop crying. Please, dear God, stop crying. Stop it! Stop it! I go to him and I, and I him? give him a little uh, snap you on know, the face. Maybe we, you know. Stop it! travel all the way hey, back. Hey, leave him family. alone. I'm not good with kids. Someone else do this. Pemus understands what it's like to be small and weak. Come with me, <laughs> small child. Pemus will look after you. <laughs> He'll grab your hand. Well, he's going to turn into an incel. <laughs> <laughs> what? You know, the world might look down on you. I used to be small too, but look oh, at me still, now. We still look down on you. 
all it took was some killing and some cannibalism, you'll be right <laughs> where I am. <laughs> okay. <laughs> all right. So, uh, <laughs> Valor will grab Pemus's hand and be led away from the angry sprite lady. All right. I just can't do it. Um, All right. Well, th thank you, your, um, your evilness. Good. Leave my home. Rotter. Do you? Rotter. You're very strong. Do you take, like, apprentices or? Wait, give, oh, oh wait, God, she's, she's resing! Give her the rod! Oh, give her the rod! Oh, oh, shit, she's, she's resing! resing. Oh, she's resing! Oh, okay. She's resing, man. Hash Brown has it, Hash Brown has it. Oh, I gave it to Brian. So oh, she's know. resing him! Brian, are you pulling out the rod? I you gave pulling it out to the Brian. Rod? Okay, she pulled out the rod. Just go! Just go! Oh, Sleep. God, kill her. She's no, we, we gotta stop her! She's fucking she's two out of them. three! I, I'm so she's confused what you're doing. Just go back. Ooh. Okay, we okay. I don't understand just why leave you guys now. didn't. Why didn't you pull out the rod? Why didn't you pull Man, out the rod? I ain't out. I ain't out the rod. Cash Brown has the rod. Why did you pull out the rod? I gave it to Brian two minutes ago. I pulled it out. Okay. Uh, you know what? Oh. Uh, we'll <laughs> just. <laughs> hey, maybe <laughs> we just. We'll just, we'll just we'll take our. Ah, oh, uh, come on, what Brian, old buddy, old pal. <laughs> you know what? We'll, we'll just take our leave. We have to leave. It just seems leave. that you were defeated. But I was able to get them to leave. Maybe we should listen to the after credits scene to Ah, uh, jeez. I'm sorry, Dame. Really let We were let old Zacky Wacky down, didn't we, boys? I'm sorry, I was so bad. I didn't have enough hands. And Halloween will start patting wise guy on the head. Alrighty. What do you guys do? I'm very um, confused child. why we didn't pull out the rod. Yeah, I mean, she was I think we were I'm actually so confused. Opportunity. I don't think we were given the opportunity. I, mm. I was waiting to hear you say it. I, we were oh. yelling at the whole time. I was waiting on Brian to say it. Mm. You know, um, so anyways, I think I, I, we can. We're friends now. Because mm. I have to go <laughs> and. Well, don't what? we have to kill her? I'm confused. Oh, no, no. We can Under come back oath, later. Yeah. Brian has to. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Oh, Brian has to. Well, I should say, technically speaking, your oath was to to satisfy what Lazarus wanted. Can't satisfy someone who's oh. dead? Yeah, he's dead now, right? Now I can't help but wonder what is it that he wanted. What did he want? What did he want? Yeah. Oh, what um... did he fucking oh what did he want Valoween for? Or I guess mm -hmm. he just was gonna Wait, fuck Brian himself. would know, right? Do you remember what he asked her? Oh, yeah, Remember what he, he was talking? looking for? Did she uh, a little ring. She dropped something. The sigil. The thing that rolled in front of me. Yeah. That I. He did he want that? Oh, maybe ask her. Ask her. We maybe could we ask. ask. Oh, we talk to her a little bit. Oh, hi. Just hey. <laughs> now you're uh, coming back. Why did <laughs> Lazarus <laughs> want you dead? Why? Have but to be clear, the boys are all messed up. They're not combatants right now. Oh, oh. we can still beat her with the rod then. Well, let's can, ask we need information. We, need we just asked the question. Yeah, yeah, info. Yeah. Hold on. Ask, ask about the thing, Brian. What? Oh, the, the, the thing that fell. What? Can you tell me more about the sigil that Lazarus wanted? That wasn't the sigil he was after. He was looking for my results. Your of results? what? Of my experiments. The child that was given to me, that one, was only the first of many. In fact, many of the dwarves have been turning on each other. Lazarus used a proxy known as Blackbriar and his family in order to steal from several other families, children and, and ciphering wealth. The Longfellows, the Black Shales, Iron Bellows, all of them. And all to fund my research. That's what he was looking for, and he did not find it. Truth be told, I am unsure if any should find it. Not even myself. What I discovered was disturbing. How much for the information? This has no price that you can pay. Although I will admit, 
it is I that seeks guidance in this. What, what, if... I, dis or what oh. I discovered is beyond my capabilities. We can help you. Oh, and how was that? I don't know, like, if you discover something really bad, we can help you get rid of it, or get more information, <laughs> or, you know, our services are pretty flexible. Persuasion <laughs> check, Lilu. Oh. Wait! <laughs> Come on! <laughs> Guys! Does anyone else want to help yeah. her out? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think um, that we, um, we are, a, yep, a mighty we're fine free group. Now. Uh, we're free. a mighty wanna... fine group. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're, we we're free. Know. We just want to know. We just want to know. Yeah, what we, found. we almost no. killed you. Oh, no. so remember when she cut know. your hands hold off on. in one hold swing? On, hold on, Hash Brown's point of we almost killed you. Anger how her strong we are. Oh, but then oh yeah. Oh. She will nod and accept, and then she will say, "I suppose you are right. Whether or not you had a device to help you, you are strong enough to have at least threatened my life. Fine." Who knows? Perhaps in the eyes of laymen, you might find the answer. But know this, that if there is a sign of any corruption in any of you, I will have to kill you. Oh, yes. Yes, yes. Kill us if we are. Uh, yeah, yeah. Very well. Boys, turn away. All right, you heard him, kid? You heard the name, boys. Looks like we're looking eastward. I like looking at walls. <laughs> if I had three hands, I could be tripod. That's, so that's not a good name at all. All right. Valoween will move over here and open a secret compartment and we'll pull out a cloth and it will and you can you can feel that there is just so much energy that even those of you that can't cast spells can feel it wafting over you as it hits you. And then slowly she will begin to unfurl it. All right. What is that? Are you guys gathering in? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yep. No, yep. I don't want to know. I got to know. Uh, what is it? What is it? Is it getting ready? She will uncover the cloth. And there you will see a crystal of bright violet light. It shines into the room. Power, wrongness, and a palpable sense of curiosity. One moment. Uh oh. That's the light. And she will say. My experiments yielded this result. It is beyond anything that I have seen. And even holding it within my hands, I have done everything I can to see that it does not touch my skin or meld with my essence. Wait. I, I have found notes from others of my profession that have spoken of this, this shard of oblivion, it is said, but I know not what it can mean. I have encountered others who speak of it. I have encountered others who possess an eye empowered with it. I have seen the power before, but I know not the process to receive this. Tell me, what do you see? Does anyone look at the crystal? Yep. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Yep. Uh, yep. We're <laughs> gonna go straight looking at it. Mm. Okay. Oh no, am I gonna go blind? It's okay, I'll also go blind with you. Okay, okay, together. As you look at the violet crystal, you can see that it swirls with violet light, but there's something else inside of it. You can't quite see it, like it's behind smoke and mirrors of shadow and sight. Something moves within it. Something alive. 
And then Valoween will say, The only thing that I've been able to discover is what one of my acquaintances was able to tell me. A dwarf by the name of Raktor Ironbellows has spoken of it. My spies have studied what he and his companions have done to some extent. Although, truth be told, I am unsure exactly what it all means. I think it has something to do with the Seven. There is a shrine not far from here, but I cannot enter it. It is the realm of the white. My flesh would burn from my body, but you are yet mortal and may enter it unabated. I am hesitant to trust you with this task, but I sense there is more to what is happening. We'll Therefore, do it. I... Nope. Therefore, I offer it to you, if you wish. Yes. Yes. We will take it. And that would satisfy the oath, right? Of Lazarus. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yes. We don't have to We like that. that. All right. We like that. Glad wow. we didn't pull out the rod. Yeah, good. Yeah. We, 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 could, we can't still pull out the rods for the rod. <laughs> I like, mean, we, hmm. we don't have to. Uh, I mean, morally, should we? I just just to show her that we're still in charge here, you know? <laughs> <laughs> show her that we have the rod, you know? All right. There we go. This is important. Okay. Who takes it? Take it in with Mark Shell. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yep, yep, yep. I'd like a thick layer of goop between it and my skin. <laughs> Yeah. All right. She will. She will carefully wrap the crystal, wrap it a little more, and then shove it into the goop of Mamad <laughs> shell. Nice, nice, nice. Ah, uh, keep it safe, okay? Hmm. <laughs> what does that mean? Mm. <laughs> All right. So, do we do that quest first, or do we get rid of Valor first? We need to return the child. Oh yeah, fuck this kid. <laughs> well, <laughs> it's horrible. Maybe he yeah, can deliver shrine, by his but, owl. The, the shrine is only a short distance away, whereas Va uh, Gallant is at the Iron, which is several days of travel really through the mountains. Oh, oh yeah. All right. What are we gonna Cal do? With is coming with what us. With child? There is also no one way. other problem that you need to keep that you need to remember is huh. that um, you're now unlawfully freed prisoners from the Iron. Ah. Now, while most people won't know that, there are those that will, especially those that you have told. Ah. So keep that in mind. Ooh. And also, if you return to the iron itself, unbranded to Gallant to give back her brother, yeah. you'll have to also take that risk that she might be more lawful than she is good. Ah, oh. luckily no, for I me. No, I think she's more good. No, I, no, no. I, I agree. I'm so grateful. What if, what if we, we have the command rod, right? Could we just put our collars back on and pretend like, oh, uh -oh Lazarus deception. has us, right? <laughs> oh, yeah. They're on the ground, right? As it just so happens, mage. as a rune mage, you could do that. Oh. Okay. That's how about, idea. how about, am I able to do it so the rod can't suicide squad blow our heads off? Correct. You know what? Let's do a little pretend. When someone, even if someone took the rod, it just gives us a little tickle on the neck. And then we'll put our collars back on. Okay. okay, that's a good right. idea. Wait, do I need I like a collar? I mean, no one knows what I look like anymore, right? Oh, no one has seen Pemus. <laughs> oh, that's true. <laughs> we just tell them Pemus died. <laughs> this is his cousin. <laughs> oh, uh -oh. I am dead. I cousin. mean, Pemus is dead. <laughs> What's your uh, new name? You uh, could always take a new name, like Doc. Yeah, Doc. You could flip Got your it. name and be Sim. <laughs> I was going to say Doc. Or shoot. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. guys can call me Doc now. Doc. <laughs> I'll change oh, your name. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's Doc. Doc. Yeah, Doc. Doc. <laughs> Doc. <laughs> yep, Doc. <laughs> okay. All right. Okay. I'll so put all your try. collars. Yeah. I'm sorry. What do we have? Yeah, the, the kid. The, from the evolution of penis to Doc. It's fantastic. 
Alrighty. Guys, the kid. What do we do with the kid? Uh, Pim, well, I'm kind of scared he'll take after Pim as if, uh... No, no, no. Yeah. I'll teach him how to be a real man. Oh, no. So, <laughs> let me talk to you about fit. women. In <laughs> yeah, can you fit Can you fit in Ramon's shell? Girls are gross! <laughs> Oh yeah, don't you, you shouldn't you shouldn't talk to girls. They they just make your life a lot harder. You do all these <laughs> things for them. <laughs> You're like, put it on. <laughs> they don't appreciate you. <laughs> no. All right. What's the uh, so what's the party going to do? All right. I guess we we're heading to the shrine. Yeah. The kid's gonna fucking die at the shrine. Can we like hide the kid somewhere? Can we drop him off at the inn or something? You can do that. Yeah. Oh yeah, we can just pay for like a few bye, days. Bye, bye, bye. Oh bye. Bye. Your yep, we'll do bye. Do you have any free gifts? Do you have any more hearts left? Any more presents? Hey, uh, hey kid. What? Hey uh, no hard feelings. Oh, no, not at all. I'm really sorry for her. I saw, right? What? Oh. Go on, sorry. Oh, yeah, I'm just, I'm sorry for kidding you. You know, you serve a really cool person. Is she taking any more? In... Bye, never mind. <laughs> that, that was... <laughs> Man, sprites are weird. I like <laughs> this wall. No, 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 no. <laughs> Four hands. <laughs> Two for each arm. Yeah. Ooh, what if I put my feet in the hands? That's what I did. Ugh. Zach's not gonna like this at all. I'll just stare oh, at the wall. This guy. <laughs> Yay, the boys! Alright. Season two, new episodes out every Friday on Amazon Prime Video. We're mm -hmm. not sponsored. <clears throat> uh. All right, I'm moving you guys. Here we go. Yeah. It's shrine time. Oh, the kid. The kid. Uh. Oh, wow. Well, this didn't turn out how I expected. <laughs> mm. Not at all. I did oh, think yeah, we were going to murder her. Yeah. I'm surprised she's alive still, and Lazarus is gone. She's so pretty. Yeah, I love her art so much. Me yeah, too. Yeah, I love it's so unique. Mm -hmm. Can I come back? Oh, hold. Okay, all right, you got him. You got her. I'm in the yeah. middle of all, all right. kinds of so, things. I guess we can make small talk. Yeah, just give me a second. I'm loading. I'm sorry, I'm loading. I'm going as fast as I can. All right, I try and impart more wisdom to Valor. So, oh, God. Pimus, you, you see those two nice lady over there? Pimus was so nice to them, but they didn't pay Pimus any attention. But after Pimus became hot, now they want to talk to Pimus. Did you just say he's hot? <laughs> Pimus, they still don't want to talk to you. Look. He thinks he's hot? Ouch. Look at my That's art. <laughs> <laughs> Look at me. I'm attracted to Babylon and Babylon only, sorry. Pimus, no matter how much you change, you can't change what's your personality. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> um. I mean, you know, Pimus, you can grow into a, you know, a, a better, you can a better man. Change. You can change yeah. for the better. What's wrong with Pimus, though? I mean, you've been, you know, you've been very mysterious. Sometimes and the way of... you talk about women, you know, yeah. it's a little, you know, <laughs> monka s. <laughs> what is monka s? You notice that? You, you notice that? You notice that Lily switched into the Sylvan language. <laughs> Sorry, back in my uh, my hometown, that means a little worrying. God, now Sylvan's gonna be Twitch speak. Monka <laughs> S RNG Bless Squad W. Oh we want God. you to become more Pog. <laughs> we want you to be more Pog and less Monka S. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right now you're being a little weird too. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> All 
All right. And so the party travels towards the Shrine of the Seven in the hopes that they can fulfill the request of Halloween and also to discover the purpose behind this mysterious shard of oblivion. Okay. Wow. Moving you here. Here we go. All right. And loading you in. Shrine of the Seven. He had it ready. Ooh, baby. I'm in. Mm, oh, yeah, this is cash. Yeah, it should be cash. So you should have most of the assets already. All right. We're here. All right. Uh, Anyone not in yet? Uh, uh, I'm in. Is the child okay? He's you've been in the shadows for a while, bud. <laughs> oh, yeah, <laughs> living child, in a well for a while. The child's just kind of looking around, like uh, I can see daylight. He's he's having a grand old time. Hey. Plus, he has a new friend named Doc, who's telling him all kinds of useful things. <laughs> <laughs> hey, how old are you? I'm thirty-seven. <laughs> what? <laughs> he's a dwarf. That means he's still a child. Oh, oh yeah, right. Yeah, 30, I, I forgot about that. Do you remember your sister Gallant? Yeah. Is she okay? She, she misses, misses you. Yes. Can you take me back to her? Yeah, yeah, we're in gonna time, do that. Doc will take care of you and teach you in the meantime. You wanna oh, hop okay. on my shoulders? <gasps> He'll, he'll he'll gasp excitingly. All right. Oh, sorry. Right. <laughs> right. And pow! Oh yeah. I fly around in a circle to uh, give him a joy ride. Uh, Who thought this would be good with kids? I don't know, man. Some of the things he was saying. <laughs> he misses our a fucking free weird. child. <laughs> Ooh, free child. <laughs> Alrighty, the way ahead lies open. Um, the, blo uh, <clears throat> the wind blows off of the mountain, carrying with it snow and cold, but it's not quite so heavy here. Up ahead, you can see a campsite where there are a couple of worshippers who, who are not important enough for tokens that are kind of uh, praying and going about their way, and you can see a shrine of the seven, a singular statue of a hooded figure pointing out towards the horizon. So, make me in a religion check first before we approach the shrine to see how much you guys know about the seven in character. I'm very religious. Nope. Ooh, you're with the 17. I right, know here. something. Mm. Ooh. Mm, I also Cash know Brown things. is religious. <laughs> the Church of Potato. Um, uh -huh. my cat stepped on my keyboard and it took away the little message chat bar thing. Does uh, anyone know how to pull that back up? I think it's Top just... Left. Top left, go to window, click that. Go down to where it says um, chat if it's not checkmarked. Perfect. Thank click you. There you go. All right. And now that is sufficient to know this. Here, have some info, guys. <clears throat> the seven, specifically, are not a traditional deity in most senses. The seven represent the seven mortals who rose up during the time of the Great Reckoning in which all of creation was threatened and faced an unnameable evil. The result of which resulted in the world being saved and the seven being somewhat forgotten, as is the cost of their service. Now, the seven serve as the symbol of hope for all creatures, for all those that have ambition or wishes, compassion, anything. They are the symbol of hope, and most alignments pay homage to them in some way. Mm. 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 All right. Mm. What, what are we doing here again? We're heading to the shrine, I think. Oh, but what are we looking for? The uh, the shard of oblivion that you're carrying with you, Valoween thinks it has something to do with the seven. Oh, and, oh, so and we on don't her know behalf, yet. You would go to the shrine to to see if anything happens. Cool. Okay, let's go. All right. As your feet fall on the cobblestone steps, and you make your way towards the statue, which you guys should see it here. Ooh. Hmm. 
All right. As you stand in the presence of a shrine of the seven, tell me what you do. Well, the monk observed the statue. The statue is old and weathered and is of a hooded individual whose face is obscured, as is tradition with most of the seven, since nobody knows exactly who the seven are. Hmm. What would you just fucking keep walking toward? Is this just keep walking? Just keep I guess. Going, like, going. Yeah, we get just, it. The statue. Just, just keep uh, walking. Can we do a perception check? Sure thing. All right. I fly around the statue, perceiving something. We. <laughs> All right. As you take a closer look at the statue, you can see that. It doesn't appear to be anything special about it. It has the symbology of the seven all over it. Uh, nothing else really seems to happen. Ramog, do you get any closer? I would love to get closer to the statue. And when you get it. to about there, something happens. The crystal in your shell begins to vibrate at an alarming rate. There is definitely a reaction. Uh, <laughs> uh, I freak it. I'm going to take the crystal out of my shell. Hold it in my hands, but with the cloth in between. Okay. As you take it out of your shell, and you got the cloth on top of it, it starts to vibrate. You kind of hold it down, trying your best to keep it in place. But it's it's vibrating with enough force that it's like threatening to break free. So whatever it's going to do, if you get close, you think it'll happen. Hmm. Hey guys, <laughs> this is happening. Maybe, maybe. I mean, I think you back uh, off. Or, or yeah, move closer. Back I'm, I'm, I'm oh, thinking oh, move closer. I was thinking okay, closer. Move closer. Closer. Okay, right. Ramog should closer. move closer. Yeah, just, Ramog. just Ramog. I was thinking yeah. Maybe everyone clear out and you know. Yeah, yeah. In case All it right, explodes, yeah, yeah. I'll take one step forward towards the statue. As you take a step forward, it breaks free of your hand. <gasps> The shard fires up and out and then stands and kind of floats in front of the statue's face, moves outwards, and then shatters into seven different points, forming a seven-pointed star that glows with violet light. Uh, I don't like this uh, violet light. Well, and That's what does that sick. what does that mean? What does that do? What, 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 what? How do we pick it back up? What? Uh, All right. And then an inscription will appear on the statue where the plaque normally was, where it says... Honor to the seven, those that came before us. It will now change completely. And there, new words will be written. Six are open. The last remains. The seventh eye. And there you see a stone dais kind of erupt up out of the ground, a pedestal, and a place where one might put their hand. So, make me an Arcana check, Ramog. Yep, I was born for this. <laughs> Fucking God. Ten is actually enough. All right. oh. The pedestal is a simple act of activation. Whatever this eye is, whatever this energy speaks to, one of you will receive it. So... Whom will place their hand upon the pedestal? Whom will take the burden of the seven? Gormok! Burden? Burden. Bur burden? That doesn't sound like a good thing. <laughs> hmm. Mm. Yeah, that doesn't you want sound to, like Ramak? a good thing. Mm. I don't know what it's going to do. But, I'm willing to sacrifice I mean, I, myself. I'm near the end of my lifespan. Oh, oh you just true, are ready true. to fucking die. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> I mean, yep. Ramog's been carrying our burdens already. We put everything in a shell, you know? <laughs> this so is like the, the symbolic... burden. <laughs> yeah, so I think it's meant for him, right? Go Ramog! Uh, yeah, go Ramog. Maybe it'll make you young right. and beautiful again. Yeah, I'll yeah. look around at the young whippersnappers around <laughs> me. Realize I got about ten, t a few days left to live anyway. And I'll put my turtley hand on the pedestal. <laughs> So be it. Oh. I have a song that I would like you to play for everyone, Toast. Yes, sir. 
and time it with me when we start. Oh, 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 oh. oh my okay. god. I'll press play when ready. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Three, two, one.
and with that lifted up within you. Ramog feels his shell begin to shift and change as he bears the runes of the master, so too do the seven impart their wisdom. His mind fills with knowledge, knowledge of the runes of the seven and of the one rune mage who came before, who held within the cube of the ocelotter all those things that are hidden away. And as such, you now know what you must do. For as one library has been found, there is yet one more place that requires the presence of the eye. It rises up ahead of you now. Your purpose made clear, no longer errant in mystery or hidden in shadow. It rises up to a singular point. You must now travel to the holy cities of Ord, where the white pantheon hold disdain and they hold proclaim. And there you must walk a path through what the Inquisition has left behind and you must find the sacred relics, for within them there lies a secret to the enemy's defeat. A secret to embolden your allies. A secret to tip the scale of the war. And so, with step by step, you move down a celestial path. Beside you, your companions walk with you, Together, you move forward. They sing within the light of your soul, emboldened, strengthened, no longer afraid, no longer a prisoner, no longer bound. Your destiny is your own, and it awaits you. So I wonder, are you ready for what is to come? Hell yes. <laughs> so be it. Oh my god. I didn't know that was gonna happen. Yeah, that is actually. So I did not. This I guy pre so cool. prepared an okay. eight-minute long speech yeah. Yeah. ahead of. He went yeah. for the whole song. The timing with the timing the with the music. That was so mm -hmm. sick. Mm -hmm. And that is where I'll have to call the session. Ah. Oh. Okay. I've oh. got to prep for the next one, guys. Yeah. Ah. All right. Okay. Oh, Holy I am sorry. Shit. That, what that an so end. Yeah. Wait. So Vimog is like. I'm like, you're the main I'm like Mormon yeah. Jesus. I'm you're like, <laughs> okay. I'm like. Wait, Superman. I thought your eyeball. You let, have the Sharingan now. Yeah, I have Sharingan. Let, let, yeah. let me explain. So, um, there are six other groups in which an eye has been opened, and you are the seventh. As you put your hand on the pedestal, you are now the seventh eye to be opened, and now the star is complete. And so now we are officially entering the end game of phase three, of, of of what I've created. And I already or the last correct. One? Wow. There are all, there are oh, yeah. And that's uh, and now I can reveal my my plans for the end game is that assuming that all the eyes survive and that schedules permit, eventually seven groups will face the Herald and the final battle to come. <gasps> oh shit. That's pretty sick. <gasps> Yeah, uh, we're pretty far behind in levels, right? Arcade, we're behind, we're level yeah. four. Oh, yeah, we're, we're level four. Hint, 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 hint. Oh, man. We'll be fine. yeah, we could use be. a few more of those. <laughs> well, you still have very much, you have a you have quite a bit of campaign left because now you have to return to Gallant to give her brother back to her. Is this true? How and... would we have gotten this the eye without what if we would have left or killed uh. uh, Valoween? We could have maybe picked it off her dead body, looted it oh, off her body. Like what yeah. if we would have left? There are ways. There are ways. Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> you would have. You would have. To uh, <laughs> to be, to be clear though, uh, once this campaign finishes, you, if you all want to, of course, um, will enter a season two for a new campaign in which you will participate in your, uh, basically, in your role as the seventh eye. And then, Ooh. and then slowly we will begin the battle against the herald. Wow. Uh -huh. Ramog main character. <laughs> yeah, he's the main oh, character oh, now. Dude, I'm imagining the all Ramog the other groups. It. They probably have like the strongest guy who opened the eye in all the groups. Badass guy. And I have Dementia Turtle. <laughs> 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 oh, this goes into a shell. <laughs> yeah. that's, uh, wow. that's, I think it's mm. so funny though. That's the beauty it. of it. Anyone can be a seven. Anyone can step up and take the mantle of hope. And oh, you are the no. one that has chosen to do that. So is Ramon like young again or something or what? 
I um, think just his right. I believe his right, right side is young, well, and the left side really looks good. like. Uh, that, that was only to show the the power of life flowing through him. He's still the same age. Aww. But now, oh, he is brimming with purpose. Wow! Does he have remember? the cool eyeball thing? He has the eyeball yeah. thing, right? To, to, to be clear, your yeah. your right pupil is a seven pointed star instead of a circle now. That's mm. okay. Wow. Like now. Wow. And, 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 yeah. Yep. And, <laughs> and, <laughs> and it glows with violet light. That's, That's so badass. Yeah. Yeah. And because you have Toman, who will who will tell you this immediately yeah. as soon as he sees you, uh, you must you must be careful on what you look at with that eye, because this is a bit of information that I get to reveal to you because it's already been revealed and it's knowledge that you would have now. The power of the violet is shared between the seven and the enemy, so whatever you see. Oh. It also sees. I patch oh, time. Fuck! I gotta be like <laughs> Kakashi. Cover the Sharingan with the cloth. Thing. Yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. You could certainly do that. Mm. Yeah. Most most of the seven or most of the the seven eyes have an eye patch or something over it like that. Mm. So. Cool. That's so cool. All right, Release you the eye. eye. Okay. That's awesome. Yeah. We finally got here. Who right. lad? Thank very you. Cool. No yeah. problem. Yeah. Amazing for speech. Mm. Yeah. See Thanks, guys. Week. Yep. I'll All see right. you guys next time. I unfortunately can't stick around because I got to go right into prepping for the next game. So okay. I'll see you guys then. Right. Bye. You guys Bye. Next Bye. Sunday. Bye, Bye guys. Mm -hmm. Bye. 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 Yep.